Hey guys, uh, okay, a few people were asking me regarding the size because they actually thought that this unit, the Hudley system, was quite bulky uh, when it came to the design and being placed on the front windshield, but it's actually not. Uh, I just want to give you a general measurement so you know if you decide to get this unit, uh, when you place it in your car, that it's actually not that bulky. But just let me show you the design of it. It'll look uh, very similar to this. What this piece doesn't have is the actual bottom plate here that is mounted onto my front windshield. And so the shape will be basically just like this when you get yours in. Uh, this will be the front. So you basically have the settings, you have the power on and off, uh, as well as the uh, left and right switching through menus. Yeah. On the side of the Hudley, you'll basically have the OBD2 connector as well as the power connector that you see there. Uh, the back, this is the back of the of the system. Hopefully you guys can see this well. And then this is the front where basically all the images will be projected from the projector there. Okay, in regards to the size itself, let me just kind of show you that it's actually not that big. Okay, so this one here, measuring across where the projector is, is roughly about three inches directly from the front here to the back is roughly about uh, three and a half inches. Yep, height wise, how much is gonna stick down from your window is not a lot, so I have it marked at the one inch all the way down. If you put the, the plate itself, probably close to three, but not really three, maybe two, uh, probably maybe a little bit past two and a half is in terms of the size. Uh, back end is obviously the same as the front itself, roughly around three inches. Yeah. Okay. The coolest thing about this too, as well, is once it's on your front windshield, you are also able to tilt it uh, both left and right. That's if the images, uh, if the images projected onto the glass itself isn't clear. I'm sorry, not clear, but not straight. So you're able to tilt it both left and right. If the unit becomes loose, all you have to do is basically use a Phillips screw screwdriver and tighten up that bolt that's inside there. So that's pretty much it. That's the design. This piece comes off. Uh, you'll be able to see all the circuits inside. Yep. And so that's that. And I put that back on. So this is the unit itself. Now the glass size, this is what the glass looks like. Uh, roughly from side to side, probably close to about six inches. Going uh, in terms of the height wise is roughly about three, but in terms of the screen itself, roughly about to three and a half. So it's not too bad at all. Okay. Uh, the mounting itself will look very similar to this. Um, sorry about that. The Okay. So this is the mounting is in terms of what it will look like. You know, you put the double sided tape on there and this will be connected directly up to your windshield and you will be able to move this in multiple directions so that's that the glass itself is in a uh, concave is in terms of the shape itself and so this is glass so don't think it's plastic okay it is glass and it is very reflective let me see if I get the angle of the, the light directly above me as you see there yeah so that's pretty much it so this is the Hudley unit, this is the glass itself, and then that is the unit. Okay, alright, hey thanks guys, I just want to show you the measurements. Alright, thank you.